Natalie O'Shea. Today is going to be talking about the benefits of the Daylight and the options available from the Daylight Company. So Natalie, who are Daylight? Daylight are a company that has been specialising in lighting options and accessories uh, for a number of years. They have high quality um, items, as you can see some of them demonstrated here, um, and we're going to be going through some of the uh, items and options that they do today. They're designed specifically for crafters. What Daylight do is they actually have um, lots of crafters that they ask their opinions and kind of say, what do you need? What are you looking for out of lights? Um, and they use the feedback from um, these people to um, design the ultimate floor lamps and table lamps and accessories. Why daylight, Natalie? Why, what's so different and important about daylight, particularly for crafters? Okay. Well, crafters, um, if they're lucky, often craft for long hours at a time, whether they're at a crop or a class all day long. Um, sometimes, if you're like myself and you're a working mother, then you're, you're working in the evening. Um, obviously, light in houses isn't very good in the evenings. Um, my craft room, personally, I've got a very small window, not a lot of available light. The light from my light bulb isn't that great. Um, I have one of these lamps and um, I use it all the time. Um, because you're doing sort of a lot of detailed work, like needle crafters and people like that, um, and again, the older you get, the more light you need. Um, there's a RNIB survey that's been done and it goes to prove that a 60-year-old needs three times as much light to see what they're doing clearly as a 20-year-old. Um, I never used to wear glasses when I was 18, but I do now, so there we go, that just goes to prove it. Um, and various um, lights, as you can see this one here, have magnifying um, glasses which you can use and things like that, so it's a lot clearer um, to use. Um, and once you've, you're sort of working in the evening, a lot of it's detailed work, and so um, I say the magnifiers are great to use. Um, a lot of these lamps are low heat lamps as well, so it actually means that you're not emitting a, a great amount of heat, which again, um, if you've got a normal table lamp, um, like ones you might have beside your bed, um, they can get very hot to touch um, and get quite intense with heat. So again, if you're using them quite close up for close up work, you're going to start getting, uh, getting quite a heat emitted from them. Um, and with daylight lights, you don't. Right. In fact, I think all daylight lights are fitted with um, low energy lights. That's heat right, yeah. Lights. Every single yeah. lamp has low yeah. energy lights. So mm. that's great. And one of the best things, one, one of the major reasons I use it personally, um, I do a lot of card making, a lot of scrapbooking, and matching colours is very important to me. Um, and because it's a daylight lamp, um, in normal daylight, you actually see different colours as what happened beforehand when I was working in the evenings. Um, some of the colour matching you could see just wasn't great when it sort of the sun came up the next morning. You went in and was like, oh, that doesn't match properly. Whereas if you've got a daylight light, um, then that isn't an issue anymore, which is great. And Natalie, why do daylight have so many different types of lamps, such a, uh, a comprehensive range? Um, well, they have different lamps basically for different people. You've got a lot of crafters out there from paper crafters like card makers and scrapbookers through to needle crafters, through to cross stitchers, through to sewers, knitting um, people who knit. And these lamps are also great as reading lamps as well. So if you do a lot of reading, um, they're perfect for that too. So depending on what sort of craft you're doing or whether you're, say, you're using it as a reading light, um, different people need different lights for different things. Daylight produce a comprehensive range of um, a variety of lamps, as, say, as I've just said, for different reasons. Um, and we're going to go through four different styles today. Um, a couple you can see here. These are the portable lamps. There's the portable and the ultimate portable. We're going to be looking at the ultimate tabletop lamp, which you can see here. And we're also going to be looking at the ultimate floor standing lamp as well. As well. And lastly, uh, there's a clip-on light that you can see here, which clips onto a table and various other things, which we'll be showing you just a little bit later.